have here two batteries that were uh, charged overnight. They are both, they've both been topped off completely, as topped off as they can be. And we're gonna do a little test to see what the flight time on these is, just hovering. Just put them up in the air and let them hover for 20 minutes and see how that goes. I think we're gonna take them to 20% battery, yep. and that'll be the end, because yep. you never wanna fly it all the way down to zero nope. by any means, or even close. So 20% uh, will be our cutoff, and we're gonna try that and see how it goes. So like I said, both of these batteries far as they can go given that they charged overnight last night. Twenty-one! Not even twelve minutes. Twenty percent. We got not even twelve full minutes. Eleven fifty-seven. Yeah. Twenty percent at eleven fifty-seven yep. on the solo. And the solo is now on the ground. So now we're just uh Oh, I love this. You have how how likely would you recommend solo to a friend? Well, oh wow. If you got twelve minutes. <laughs> You're good to go. Now, granted, that solo is a year old. It's and, a year old. And, the and that battery are older. is that yeah. battery is somewhere between a year old. Sure, I mean, has a few flights on there's it. There's all those considerations, but and it's a little windy, like I said, but still. Yeah, 12 you, minutes. You seems... know, I was flying aggressively on an average battery, and I don't time all my flights, but I bet I'm getting 10 minutes flying aggressively and doing interesting shots, right? Which is not uh, not all that great, really. But that's going to be true for any of them, right? If we were flying this Phantom in sport mode, you're not going to be anywhere close to this. So we're at 45% at 13 minutes. 15 minutes and 15 and a half minutes, and we're at 34% battery. So what do you think we have another eight minutes or so? Probably. Six to eight. They tend to drain faster as they get lower. Right, it's, good, right? it's just like kind of gas in your car when you get when your empty light comes on. Like you're gonna die quick. So that's true with life of And it's fighting some wind right now. Oh yeah, it's pretty windy out here. So the 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 weather uh, app right now is saying that the wind is 9.9 .9 miles an hour, 10 10 miles an hour basically, which is not ginormous, but it is definitely uh, significant. So you can see what it's doing with the wind. It's it's uh, it's holding steady, but it's definitely pushing against it at 10 miles an hour. 28. Yeah, it's going down faster. It's going down faster. Okay, we're gonna get a little over 20. Is the amount of battery left, and time is 18 minutes. I'm trying to get with the green light working. Actually, you want oh, to we're at 20. All right. 1855. Uh, 
So we took them both up in the air, uh, tried to make it pretty equal. This one lasted just under 12 minutes, right? 11.58, yep. something like that. Yep. This one lasted uh, just under 19, 19 minutes, so 18.50 something. Yep. So obviously a little bit more time. Now in fairness, um, number one, there's a good wind today, uh, about 10 to 12 miles an hour, blowing pretty consistently. Uh, number two, this solo is almost a year old. Uh, we got it last June. Uh, April now, so I'm tired and old. <laughs> Although I have to say, I don't have that many flights on the battery, so um, you know where the battery is right now. But you know, still probably could have done a little better. And this this one's fairly new. This maybe is the third flight on that battery, third or fourth tops. So uh, in you know, and, and both of them were equal with the camera. We ro rolled the cameras, um, all that kind of thing. So uh, so basically six more minutes. Yeah. almost and seven it's, more it, minutes. It's on this obvious that it's a it's a better it's a newer craft. It's a larger battery. And you know the thing, your mileage is literally going to vary on batteries. Obviously, it depends on what you're doing. It depends on the efficiency of the motors. It depends on the life of the battery. Of course, this is going to last longer. The key takeaway is if it's never what's advertised. You know, the advertised flight time is ideal, probably laboratory conditions. Hell, it might not even be up in the air at that point, right? But you know, without the gimbal and without recording, maybe the motors last the advertised flight time. But you're never going to get that, right? You can subtract. 20 30 percent between what anybody advertises but uh i will say i mean, we should do some more tests but i mean it's it's a little disappointing on how little flight time you get out of the solo uh and what i've seen most people are getting between 10 and 15 minutes you know on an average imagine if you were flying it around doing crazy stuff you you wouldn't even get 12. True. so That's take it for what it's worth buy more your, batteries all your accessories on it yeah exactly so buy lots of batteries <laughs>